Here it is. So we've had a leadoff walk. Infrio coming up. Here's the pitch. Fastball misses high. And they've got first and second with one out. Goals. Down the one, two. Yeah. Oh, strike three. Yeah. 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 Here's the 3 0. Oh. Yeah. 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 Three straight in. Doing that, you're playing with fire. First, this one gets past Rogers, and that's going to allow Bilesmith to go to second on an E1. So a throwing error. And now they've got the runner at second base. So it just hasn't been a smooth start here so far here for Georgia. Al Smith gets his lead, and this one is lifted out to right. Connor Tate makes the catch in front of the track. Miles Smith will go to third. So coming up from Bearden, here's the pitch. This one is lifted out to left center field, and making a long running catch is Jernigan. But that'll be plenty deep to score Miles Smith from third. And it's a sacrifice fly for Tanner Craig. He owns the career record at Pope as he hits this one. Third base side, knocked down, and the throw not in time, and a great play by Kevin. The whole buddy pull into an infield single. That one with Randon Jernigan, who bunts this one over on the first base side. Pitcher shakes out, the first one. with that great speed. Lays down a beautiful butt. He's able to beat it out. The dogs have first and second here with nobody out. News from the Coliseum. Tate gets the butt down here, back to the pitcher. Schultz will throw over to first, and the throw falls about to bat. They'll try to come in and score. Guy gets away over towards the dugout. Was a bad news Bears play all the way today. And Georgia turns it into a run to tie the game. And on that wheel play, the second baseman Sherry came over to cover the bag. Now the pitch. This one is lifted out into medium left field. Tagging from third is Jernigan. The throw coming in, not in. It's Georgia, a 2-1 lead on the sack fly by Corey Collins. The pitch coming up. Swing and foul tip. Kamenoski hangs 2-2 pitch coming up. This one is lifted out to right. Miles Smith underneath, he will make the catch to retire the side. the 3-2. Swing and a miss. Actually a foul tip, but Gonzalez hangs on. And a bit. Here's the 3-1. That one misses downstairs, ball four. So first and second here with one out. Now the pitch. This one is popped up. Right side of the infield. Floyd calls everybody off and makes the catch to retire the buses in DeKalb County. As this one is chopped back up the middle and knocked down by the second baseman, but it'll be an infield hit for Gonzalez. So now the 3-1 pitch to Rogers. This one's hit out into right field. That's going to drop for a base hit. This one's up against the wall. 
Gonzalez on his way to third. Rogers to second, and he is thrown out. Wow, what a throw by Bilesmith to get Rogers at second. Thought that was going to be an easy double all the way, but instead, it's just a long single for G. And then a nine to six put out to retire the side. Excuse me, here's the one, two. Close strike three. And Sully records his first Bulldog strikeout. The 0-2 coming up from Sully. Close strike three, fastball on the outer half for out number two. Now the pitch, that one misses high, ball four. Now Sully delivers. This one is lifted out to center. Anderson had him play perfectly. He'll make the catch to retire the side. Now the pitch, this one's lined out to center for a base hit. And a good start to the Georgia seven. The one. This one is bunted nicely. Third base side and a good throw by the catcher Kamanowski. And all the way around to third is McAllister. How about that? That is a sack bunt to move McAllister from first to third. Now the umpires want to have a word about something. Let's see what they're going to discuss. Here's the pitch. This one's hit high out to right. Going back is Bilesmith. He'll have room as he makes the catch at the track. Tagging and coming in to score for a third is McAllister. And Georgia extends the lead to three to one. Sack fly for Anderson. He drives in his first run of the season. That'll bring up the short. Gowan takes over. Gowan strikes him out looking. Called strike three by the home plate umpire, Jonathan Bacon. At the 3-2 pitch, here it is. Fastball misses away, and it's a two-out walk. So here's the pitch. This one's hit on the ground to short. Cole Tate has it, flips to the back at second. Floyd standing right there to retire the side. To Collins, misses away, ball four. Runner going, check swing, not there, and Stinson is safe with a stolen base. And I thought, I'm sorry, I thought Tate might have fouled that off, but now the 1-1. That one bounces up there, gets away from Kamenowski, and that'll allow Stinson to go to third on the wild pitch. A golden opportunity. The 2-2 coming up here to Tate. This one is lined over the shortstop's head out into left field. That'll be a base hit as Stinson comes in to score, and Georgia now leads it 4-1. to one. And What a great job by Cole Tate. The dogs taking advantage of the infield B and N. That was a great leaping try there at short. But, DJ, if the infield's at normal depth, that's probably a line out to short. But with that infield yep. drawn in, opens up a lot more angles, opens up a lot more. This one's a chopper back to the pitcher, Meyer. He'll flip the first to retire the side. So that'll be good. Here's the one, two. Cold strike three. Fastball, knee high, inner half. And you mentioned some slot. Bus ride home. Swing and a miss. And Pearson has struck out the first two batters he's faced. He's got, he pitched two innings as that pitch misses away, ball four. So we've seen several players this weekend pitch and hit. Here's the pitch. This is high, ball four. So Bowsman, four walks on the afternoon, and that is the 10th. For Georgia pitching, and now the tying run does come to the plate. Now the 0-1. This one is hit on the ground on the left side. Cole Tate at short has it. Throws on the first in time, and that'll do it. As Georgia gets the 4-1 victory here over Evansville, winning the final three games of the four-game series. After that season-opening loss, this was the goal that Georgia had for the rest of the weekend, and.